Hello, this is Dan, and one question I get a lot at conventions whenever I do a podcasting panel is, how do you record Skype and do it well, which is the important part. Most people use a, um, like, Audio Hijack Pro, or they use something that basically records it within the computer. problem with that is, is basically when you get the file, there's not a whole lot you can do with it. I mean, other than levelating it and spending time trying to fix it, there's not a whole lot you can do. So this is how I record me and MAMPA, both of us. Um, we record Skype for our shows. Um, we're, this is our first MacBook in our setup. This is primarily used for Skype. Basically, all this is used for is facilitating the Skype conversation. Um, right now, it's signed into my blog account. I'm going to be doing a Skype interview later today, actually in a couple hours. If you notice, we've got both of the plugins going in and out. Um, this is the headphones in jack. This is actually coming out and going into line 7 and 8 on our mixer. So the reason why it's going into 7 and 8 is so that way it's going into our other computer as its own separate track. What's coming out of the mixer itself, you can see we've got our outs over here. This is an Alesis Multimix 8 Firewire. It's coming out from there, and that is going into the Mac, into our input. So basically what happens is, is every all the magic that happens here goes out and goes into here into Skype. So that way the person on our conversation hears it as well. So that's a really good thing, so they can hear the whole conversation. Now this, I've got our mic set up over here. I've got one mic set up to basically do my side of the conversation which is going into input one here on the Alesis Multimix 8. Um, over here is our redundancy uh, or a backup. We have an H2 and the H2 is actually we have a headphone coming out from here and we have it split. One headphone coming here to my Sennheisers and one headphone coming out to here which is the H2. This is basically recording everything that I hear. So if the Mac over there fails, which these things happen, that will that's basically a non that's basically a hardware based recorder, so it's gonna keep recording no matter what, and that does an awesome job. So whatever you hear in your headphones is going into there. Okay. So this is coming out to Firewire over to our other computer on the bed, which this is running GarageBand. As you can see, I have two tracks. Track one is me, and track two is the Skype input. Um, the Skype input is set to seven and eight stereo, if you can see that. Um, Firewire monitor on, so that way I can hear it. I usually like to have a monitor going on both sides so that way I can check what's going on. Now this is getting the signal from the Firewire Multimix 8 so that way I'm getting two separate tracks here. Now here's the here's why you do two separate tracks because that way if the person in Skype is coming in hot you can fix that in post or you can basically boost them up and turn yourself down or if their Skype um, quality is not that great, you can export that as its own track, fix it, level it, bring it back into GarageBand, and voila, put it on the other side of the conversation, and you're talking to somebody who has pretty good audio quality. So that's recording both of those tracks while that's going on. So that is how I do Skype. Don't mind the room, it's a little messy. We're getting ready to go away this weekend, and I just wanted to put this up there to let people know how we record Skype. Thank you.